<laughs> All right, we're back. All right, I, I that came never back. Happened. Yeah, Felix was scaring us. She's, you're telling us horror stories. All right, fine. So this one time, a guy <laughs> stuck his dick in a girl's asshole, was covered in shit, and he tried to stop ah. my mouth. I stopped. No, don't want to go there. God, you're real fun. Oh today. my god. All right, tell me about this shit. I'll, I'll listen to scat stories. <laughs> really? Yeah, my dad used to tell me them when uh, to put me to sleep, so I, I can listen to a scat yeah. story. It's like so. This one time, I had a girl bent over, and uh, I stuck my penis in her, and you're like. Really, Daddy? <laughs> <laughs> yes, it's very soothing, those stories, you know. No, they're not. <laughs> when the rosebud comes up to attack you. <laughs> oh, God. What is it, chupacabra or something like that? Like, it's a, like, demon? What's, yeah. Yeah. So, <laughs> like, it's the same thing. The rosebud to me is that same demon. What Now, honest, uh, what do you do to prepare for your anal scene? Everybody always asks this, but nobody, you always get various answers, so I'm uh, curious. Nothing. Nothing? Nothing. To uh, show up. I know pretty much where my body is all the time. I know my diet. So it's like as long as you stick to your diet, um, you should be good for the scene. I always believe too, if you feel like you're going to shit on the dick, you're going to shit on the dick. I've never shit on the dick without any prep ever with uh, yeah. at home and then on camera, never. So. Do you figure that that's just the risk that's worth taking? Because I mean, you're giving up your ass. It's so, you know, if the accident happens. I Thank mean, you. Forever you. Right? So apparently you do wait on at home. <laughs> I mean, no, not that you do anal, you give anal. Let me, let me fix that. But it's like, it's true. Like, when guys are like, oh my god, I can't believe she shit on my dick. Oh, like, yo, it's her asshole. I know, that's special, you know? Yeah, Mo most average guys have to wait till like marriage to get that, you know? They really? Is that how long you waited? Cost, cost a lot of money, a lot of dating, a lot of effort, a lot of time. I know some girls. A lot of I'm alcohol. <laughs> right? Just the alcohol alone will break you, you know? This is true. Well, no, like, for me, like, I don't, I don't need anything in order to do anal. Uh, I don't take any pills or like, oh, I need to. Right. I love anal sex. Nice. Um, but like, I'll see if I want at home to do like a sh margarita and then like the lime from the margarita makes your mouth really wet. So it's the best blowjob you'll ever fucking get in your life. Whoa. Why am I single? I'm not really sure. Guys. <laughs> Just you know, one margarita and I'm like dating somebody. Oh, it's on. I'm fucking murdering you. Sloppy blowjob, tons of spit. All Just my one margarita. Just one margarita. Oh, no, New Year's? I had oh, two shots and I felt like I was dead and my girlfriend's dying because she's like, you had two shots. Well, I don't drink. People don't understand. I'm fucking insane without any additive. <laughs> That's why I'm so afraid. Like everyone's like, oh, you want to try Molly? Wow. You want to try this? I was like, yo, don't need Molly. It's I'm like, always horny. It's like you're so sexy yet so scary at the same time. It's <laughs> I don't know what to do. Say that about me? <laughs> <laughs> It's like, oh my god. I hear this all the time. But then I just want to cuddle, okay? And then you just want to cuddle. Okay. Lily, 